What song am I thinking about? Hmm. My heart will go on and on. That one? That was awful. <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stream of directs. It's up, Corbin. I was thinking about Bicycle by Queen and Close on Instagram. Instagram. Oh, it's the person YouTube channels. Links in the description below. You know, if you do this, the juicy content gets thicker. Also, that song is not actually about bicycles. In case you didn't know, that. didn't know that. It's a secret. Yeah, it's a little unknown. A little fact. unknown fact. Of he wasn't actually just singing about bicycles. He didn't want to ride a bicycle. <laughs> <laughs> Great song, though. Great song. Uh, today we are wrecking to Nawazin. Nawazin Siddiqui. His new trailer came out just yesterday. Sorry, we just got to it. I apologize. Nawazin Siddiqui. We were finished. Mazipur? Yes. If you'd like to see the full uncut versions of those, go on YouTube. Somebody got mad, somebody, they didn't get mad, but they like took exception to the fact I posted on Instagram that Indrani and I had just watched the first, because it just dropped Ratchet on oh, yeah. Netflix. They're like, yeah, you know Nawaz is a new show on Netflix? I'm like, oh. Yes, we're getting to it, promise. Calm down. Uh, but yes, this is called Serious. Men. Ah, uh, yes. Comes out October 2nd, the serious guys. Is that a sequel to the not so serious guys? Is this a story? Let's read this. The story follows Ayan Mani, a middle aged Dalit, lower caste, working as an assistant to a Brahmin, upper caste, astronomer at the Institute of Theory and Research in Mumbai. He lives in slum with his wife and a son. Furious at his situation in life, Ian develops an outrageous story that his 10-year-old son is a mathematical genius. A lie which later gets out of control. Cool. So this is his way of figuring out how to get out of the slums by pawning his son off as a mathematical genius. And more Nawazin and Siddiqui all the time. Every day. We've gotten two this year. Does he play the 10-year-old son? I, he could. He could. He's that good of an actor. <laughs> Life Why should I shut my mouth for the sake of science? <laughs> he got Obama to follow him. What about Shah Rukh Khan? Dad, 
<laughs> don't don't get, get ahead of yourself. <laughs> Looks cute. Um, so why did he fall down though? I'm confused by that part. Yeah, I don't know why he fell down. I also am not sure how he can pawn off this kid so well who seems to actually have a level of brilliance. I'm wondering if like he's talking in his ear or something. Maybe. That's what I, I thought, or maybe he's actually smart. He's maybe just, just not a genius. The genius that he claims him to be. Uh, and he also, um, the, it's based on a true theory of the middle class. That was, I don't, I don't know what the theory is. Me neither. Yeah, I don't yeah, know. Is it the theory that he was saying that it doesn't happen until the fourth generation when he was talking about that? My dad was first, I'm second, this kid will be third. Uh, what happens when you find out your child is a genius? That's the dream of every Indian parent. Probably not. Is it? You can finally claim to have a child better than Sharmaji Kabeta. Hearing your son being called the junior APJ Abdul Kalam, the next Einstein, may sound great, but is it all that attention positive? Uh, Ayan and Ojamani want their son to shine thanks to his talents. They want him to be successful and defy the odds to better the condescending serious men around them. But will he? To know, check out this Nawazuddin Siddiqui, Indira Tawari. So this uh, doesn't starter. say anything about it being fake. The, no. The... I guess the, he's, he is a genius. He's just not at the level that everyone's claiming him to be. Hmm. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, but I, I honestly... I, I would like to see another trailer because, yeah. I mean, I'll watch anything Nawaz does, but... Um, I don't think we'll get one. It comes yeah. out October 2nd. Why did he fall down? Is it because of the stress he was under? Harry? Harry? Is it the stress he was under? Yeah, I don't, I don't know why he fell down. I'm confused at that part. Yeah. And I also don't know that this wasn't necessarily the story in and of itself isn't compelling enough to make me want to watch it. The fact that Nawaz is in it makes it compelling. Yeah. But the story itself isn't very compelling to yeah, me. Yeah, it definitely didn't jump off the screen for sure. No. Uh, in terms of, uh, oh, gotta, gotta, gotta see this. Gotta, you know, kind of yeah. one like that. I mean, it has Nawaz. Yep. And, it, and it's not that it looks bad. It's not like it's a no. bad trailer. Not it's not a bad, bad trailer. It's just, it, current in its current form, uh, it's like, Okay, uh, but I'll probably let you guys tell us if it's if it's worthy. One hundred. My suspicion is that this will have an intrigue for an Indian audience because of so many things that they can relate to and understand, mm. like the title itself, "Serious Men." I have no context for that. No. Also, don't have any context for what it means if it really is this expectation, which we've learned so much about Indian families of fill in the blank that we just don't have here. Mm -hmm. So my suspicion is we'll probably hear a lot of stupid babies saying, yeah, here's what you need to know and you should watch it yeah. because it's going to cover this and it's really important and it's rooted and grounded in stuff that's intriguing to us because it's in our lives. Whereas for us, it's like, okay, I don't understand. And I'm, we're obviously open to that. So we trust you. Uh, I wonder who the director is. Did you see? I didn't see who the director was of it. Um, I mean, one thing we can absolutely relate to that we know and we knew even before we were exposed to India was the, the different treatment, uh, not just of the middle class and upper class, but cast. Yeah. Yeah. It's directed by... Uh, Sudhir Mishra. And I don't know him. Looking at writers, I don't know that I know any of those names per se. No. Recognize anybody except for Nawaz. Yeah, but he he does have a tendency to pick some films that like about issues that right. like, he cares about and usually good quality. Like his film that came out earlier this year that was a, a good film and had a message right uh, in it as well. Well, um, and it, it it maybe it resonated with him in the fact that it's a character who is wanting to achieve and strive and see success for his family in a world that looks down on him. Yeah. Nawaz can relate to that personally. Yeah. So, yeah, let us know what you think. Yeah, let us know what we missed out yep. on, uh, what we need to know, uh, and then obviously when it comes out, let us know how it is and if we should give it a gander. Yeah. Gander.